Ladies and gentlemen, there now follows an announcement for everyone who wants to work with improved, safe mobility in our society. Our proverbial train is leaving in a few moments. You are kindly requested to take your seat. The destination of this journey will be a digital model of the entire Dutch infrastructure in which the traffic flow is made visible. We wish you a pleasant journey. In the meantime, we are on our way, but boarding is still possible. Digital collaboration is essential to be able to make good decisions concerning new construction and the management and maintenance of our roads and rail. Collaboration between all stakeholders. In addition, all relevant information is exchanged in a structured and uniform manner. The information is collected only once and used multiple times. The goal is to make the information available in a digital model throughout the life cycle of the construction. This is possible with a BIM, a Building Information Model. ProRail and the Dutch Ministry of Public Works have already established such collaboration. Together with the construction partners involved, they are working with a BIM, based on an open standard. In the first phase, the primary objective is to simplify the information provision in the construction of projects. So we test a BIM in practice, in project and management organizations. The work on site can then be followed in an easier and more transparent way. But eventually, as we head towards the final destination of our journey, current information on traffic loads and passenger flows will also become visible in conjunction with the digital model. The effects of expansion and maintenance can be simulated. Thus, better information can help in assessing complex considerations about the expansion, management and maintenance of roads and rail. During our journey, we will arrive at various intermediate stations. One is the IDS, the Information Delivery Specification. We now have arrived in 2012. IDS is a part of a contract where it is agreed the who, how and when about the information provided for a building project. At the following stations, which we will reach in 2014, uniform and structured information has been laid down concerning the roads and rail we need. In the IDS, information is recorded concerning static aerial, asset management, system engineering, contract management and performance management. Take static aerial. By this, we mean the bundling of all physical construction components that make up the infrastructure. So, for example, the bridge as part of the infrastructure network, the bridge as a whole and the specific elements of the bridge. A description is given of the collection of objects, the requirements, performance, documentation and archives in a given management area. With this aggregate information, you can determine when maintenance is due for a specific part of the infrastructure, for example on this bridge. So a great improvement. At present, work is carried out with existing open standards and structures. They form the basis for a future permanent open standard for the entire infrastructure sector, where building information concerning the various software systems is exchanged in a structured and uniform way. This is further developed with all relevant leaders in the field, with the aim of having them adopted as standard within the EU. The road to digital collaboration and virtual construction results in an improvement in the quality of the infrastructure. They are in line with society's needs for sustainable solutions and connects the various functions of our public spaces. The BIM train has now set off. It's on the way. The Dutch Ministry of Public Works and ProRail are calling on all leaders to also get on board and to gain experience together in how we can contribute to sustainable, smart solutions for smooth and safe mobility. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your confidence in the building of improved safe mobility in our society. We also invite you to join us again on our next trip. We wish you a pleasant continuation of your trip towards the final destination, the BIM.
the digital model for the entire infrastructure in the Netherlands.